Hi, I'm Dorothy Willits with Willits Design & Associates. And thank you so much for joining me. We're gonna be talking today about the initial meeting, which is part of our How to Work with a Designer series. So that first step in working with an interior designer is that initial meeting. And that's so important because this is where you're gonna interview me and I'm gonna interview you and we're gonna determine how we're gonna to work together. Now that we've decided to work together, we need to determine what the scope of the project's going to be. In other words, are we building a new home for you? Are we remodeling your kitchen? Are we doing a complete gut remodel of your existing home? We need to just kind of figure out how we're gonna to work together and what exactly I'm gonna be doing for you. Now that we've defined the scope of work for your project, we need to put that team together. Building the team is really important. It's kind of like a marriage. You're gonna be working with all of us for a while. So we need to put together that architect, that builder, the landscape architect, and any specialists we might need for the project. Let's talk about your needs for the project. In other words, lifestyle questions. Who sleeps on which side of the bed? Do you read in bed? You're gonna need a light behind you for the book, right? Or do you swim? Or maybe you're gonna want a lap pool. Um, are there children involved, grandchildren involved? Do you have dogs? Does the furniture need to be dog friendly? These are all the questions we need to talk about and answer so that your project is perfect for you. For example, one of my clients loves art and part of the project was to collect art. And so we created a really cute little bonus room where you could display their art books and just cozy up with one of those and enjoy an afternoon. Communication is an important part of the project. We're gonna be working together for a while. So we need to determine what you're comfortable with. Obviously, there's multiple forms of communication to us that are available at this point. We've got phone, we've got fax, we've got texting, we've got Zoom. We have a million different things to choose from. Whatever's most comfortable for you. And now, of course, with COVID, Zoom has become much more popular and it's a really great tool that we can utilize um, during the course of your project. I hope that you've learned something about the initial stage of working with an interior designer. Our next video will be about the conceptual stage. I look forward to hearing from you. If you have any questions, give us a call, text, or Zoom. Thanks.